In this video, I will tell you about the stretch command of AutoCAD and using a stretch tool, you can change the shape of geometries in very particular ways. For example, in this case, we have this bathtub and let's say that we want to increase the length of this bathtub. For that, we can use the stretch tool. So select the stretch tool from the modify panel and now select the objects. But in this case, you need to select objects in a very specific way. And if you expand this command line, you'll notice that it's also prompting you to select it with only crossing window or crossing polygon. So now in order to make a crossing window, I'll click on the right side and I'll move my cursor towards left just like this. And here we have this crossing window with dashed boundaries. Now in this case also, I'm not selecting the complete bathtub. Instead, I'm selecting it only partially. Now all the objects which are completely inside this crossing window will remain unaffected and all the objects which are completely outside this stretch window will also remain unaffected. So in this case, this line segment, this complete arc and this line segment, this part of geometry will remain completely unaffected. But the length of these four lines will change because in this case, only these four lines are partially inside and partially outside. So now simply click at any point to make this stretch window and press enter. Now click anywhere and click on any side where you want to stretch it. So in this case, you can see that the length of only those four line segments, which were partially inside and partially outside our window is changing and rest of the geometry is completely unchanged. So you can decrease or increase the length here just like this. Now, similarly, if you want to change the geometry here also, you can do that. So I'll once again, select the stretch tool. And now in this case, let's assume that we want to increase the height of this panel here. And we want to keep this panel unchanged. So for that, we need to make this stretching window in a specific way, just like this. Now, in this case, we have these six line segments, which are crossing this crossing window and they are partially inside and partially outside rest of the geometry will remain completely unchanged so let's click press enter click at a point and now move upwards and you'll notice that only the six line segments which were partially inside and partially outside have changed their length and rest of the geometry remain completely unchanged now let's assume that we want to change its length even further and we want to increase its length in horizontal direction for that, I'll select this stretch tool, click at a point here, make this window like this. And obviously now you understand that which part will be affected. So in this case, all of these segments are partially inside and partially outside. So only the length of these segments will change. So now press enter, click at a point and stretch it just like this. So in this way, we can use a stretch tool in AutoCAD to change the shape of geometries or stretch them in a particular way.